So the clothing that I'm bringing is all really casual and comfortable stuff. Um, basically, anytime I go anywhere, I pack according to what I'm going to be doing. I'm just bringing comfortable stuff that I can mix and match together so that I can wear some of it multiple times and not have to bring that much. So over on the left, I have a thermal and some joggers that I'm going to be using as pajamas, and I will probably drive back in those on Monday night. And then the little square on top of the thermal is a tank top. In the middle, I have a plaid shirt and a sweater. And these are just a slightly nicer look that I can layer together for church on Sunday. And the sweater is nice and long and oversized, so I will wear that over the leggings. And then the last things that I have are a simple casual t-shirt and a couple pairs of socks. Because it is Saturday and I'm leaving today, I will just be wearing the outfit that I drive in all of the day. So I really only needed to pack for Sunday and Monday and some pajamas. For hygiene and skincare things, starting over on the left, I have my Clarisonic, my Juice Beauty cleanser, uh, my toner, my nighttime serum, my daytime moisturizer, and a spot treatment that I also use at night. The headband is what I put my hair up with when I'm washing my face just so that it doesn't get all wet. I have my toothbrush and toothpaste, deodorant, and then my everyday makeup bag, which has all my makeup and brushes all combined into it. And if you're wondering, I don't bring any hair stuff really when I go visit my parents. If I need anything like dry shampoo or a styling tool, I will just use what they have there. Otherwise, I have hair ties and bobby pins and I like to just do heatless, easy kind of styles when in there. And last, this is my little miscellaneous row. So I have my laptop and charger. I have my daily devotional book and a book that I borrowed from my parents' house that I'm gonna return. And then I have my everyday purse, and I'm actually going to do an updated what's in my purse video very soon because I've been carrying this for a few months and I really, really like it. Now, if you've seen any of my other packing light videos, which I will link for you guys in the description box if you want to check out some other ones, but if you have seen some of them, then you probably have seen this bag before. This is my collapsible duffel bag that opens up to be the size of a carry-on. And I love this because my apartment does not have a lot of storage space, so even though I'm pretty minimal with what I own, I just really do not have the space to dedicate to a suitcase. This is what it looks like when it's opened. It has a big compartment that is the carry-on size with two little handles. There's also a removable shoulder strap, but I don't usually feel the need to do that unless I'm going to be flying and I need to carry it through an airport. So here's the bag all packed. I just put it, my clothes in kind of a flat layer and then laid my laptop and books on top. And then I kind of split my toiletries into wet and dry in those front compartments. If you've seen some of my other videos and so you're wondering why there are a few things missing, um, I decided not to bring my contacts this time. I'm just going to wear my glasses for the weekend. Of course I'm bringing underwear. I kind of just figured it was implied and I didn't need to show it. And as far as shoes and my coat and watch and other things that I wear every day, when I travel, I really like to have one pair of shoes and one coat if I can get away with it. It does take a little more planning with outfits to make things be really versatile and kind of mix and match and pick a coat and shoes that are going to work with everything. But I feel like that planning really pays off. So here is my stuff all packed up. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. As I said, I will leave links down below for other packing light videos that I've done and for options for a suitcase like this if you're looking to get something that's really easy to store. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up or leave me a comment to let me know. If you want to, you can subscribe to my channel to see new videos from me every week, and I will see you guys next time. Bye everyone!